didn't execute. We looked tired coming off that tournament. Any questions? Period of five games in nine days, I think it was. Uh, it's it poor schedule. Poor schedule on my part. Got another game Wednesday, another game Sunday. So we don't have a lot of players, but we didn't know that up front. But it's still you gotta play hard, you gotta be smarter. <clears throat> we didn't come out. Look tired, look really, really tired. Do you think that some of those turnovers there in the first half were due to that, just some fatigue there at the beginning? I don't I don't want to give them excuses. A lot of the turnovers because we we're not good passers. We don't post, we don't seal. I mean you know, I think we're tired. I think defensively we look tired. Offensively, heck, we make those same pass turnovers all year long. Coach, just your comments on Alexis Brewer's performance today. Yeah, we need her to get in shape, Keep continue to get in shape. She's coming off an injury, and she did some good things. She settles it down now. She understands the game. She plays harder, and she's more aggressive, and we'll block out. You know, we, we got a lot of work before we get into conference play, a lot of work. Another game for you with over 20 points, but it seemed there in the final period, you think maybe you left a couple shots out there or kind of what was happening with a few of those missed shots for you? Um, Maybe, I don't know, my legs, you know, they've been tired, so I passed up a lot of shots. Coach Carey, he tells me to, you know, I should look for my shot more, but I'm very unselfish. <clears throat> and he had said maybe he was concerned with a little bit about fatigue for the whole team uh, being such the turnaround with the tournament. And this, Do you think you saw that a little bit, you know, just out there on the floor, not only in yourself, but uh, your teammates as well? Yeah, uh, I, I think we came out and looked sluggish. Uh, even in shooting around today, you, you could tell that the energy wasn't there, and we tried to pick it up during halftime, doing timeouts and stuff, but it'll get better. Since there was a fatigue factor on, and you girls have played a lot of games in a sl uh, small stretch there. Um, yeah, I think the girls, I mean, um, especially our guards, they play like a high number of minutes down there D um, due to the fact that we're limited at that position right now due to injuries. But I mean, it's just something that we know that we have to push through. And I think that, I mean, this game was a tell all this sort of first time where we have to go through um, traveling, playing three back to back games, and then, um, you know, coming back home and having the game within the one day like turnaround. So. I think, I mean, it's a like learning experience for us and I think that it just, we just have to go back and look at the film and then fix what we need to fix for Wednesday. Uh, what's the group think o about overall with, despite the miscommunications, turnovers that you girls had, you still put a pretty bad, 82 points up? Um, you know, I think we, we definitely have scores on our team, but I mean, we just have to prepare for what we're going to face in the Big 12. And even though we can put up numbers like this against um, um, these um, di a different conference, I think that we're going to the Big 12. I mean, the girls are much bigger, stronger, and um, it's a more physical kind of play. So um, I don't know if we can go night in, night out scoring 80 points. Sometimes we're going to have to rely on our defense and with a lot of miscommunications that, you know, that can cause us to be in a bad, bad position.